Good morning, brothers and sisters. Uh, after praying about it for a couple of days, the Lord has moved my heart to put out a dream that I received the other night. Um, first, I want to talk about this. Uh, this is at Times of Israel. The U.S. readies the Mideast Peace Plan rollout next month, okay? Now, if this is the seven-year peace treaty, the long-awaited seven-year peace treaty, that means the rapture has to happen before it's signed. We don't know how long before it's signed, five minutes before it's signed, you know, a month before it's signed, but we have to go up before it's signed because the peace treaty sets off the seven-year tribulation. Okay, this says the administration intends to release the peace plan in mid to late June, okay, shortly after the end of Ramadan. Okay, Ramadan ends on June 15th. Okay, so, all right, this article is a couple of days old. Um, I don't know, I haven't been watching the TV news about it. So I don't know what further develop, developments may have occurred. But um, this shows that Trump is ready to try to push this Mideast peace plan through. So this is very important. This is a big deal. This is very, very important. And we have these volcanoes going off. The volcanoes in Hawaii just keep on erupting and keep on erupting. And uh, I heard a pastor say, I can't remember who because this was a couple of years ago. I heard a pastor say, a well-respected pastor, say to watch the volcanoes. Keep your eye on the volcanoes. When the volcanoes start acting up, the rapture is about to happen. Okay, I heard a pastor say that. And, uh, you know, that Hawaii volcano just keeps going on and on. And uh, also, I would like to show you this here. Now, I've been on YouTube for five years making videos. And I, don't, I pretty much don't watch, you know, rapture dreams and visions from only a handful of people. A very small handful of people that I really trust. Now this lady, Seek and Ye Shall Find is her channel name. I trust her. She's one of the very few I really trust. She's not an attention seeker. She's not here to build her channel. In fact, she, she hardly ever posts. Like six months might go by before she will post a video. And I know she hears from the Lord. And I really trust, you know, when she posts a video, you know, my ears perk up. And now she just re-released this video here, period of May 22. <coughs> Excuse me. My voice is going. Please pray for me. I have some health problems. I really need prayer, you guys, for health problems. I hardly ever ask for prayer, but I really need it now. And I would really appreciate your prayers. Um, okay, but let me get back to the subject matter. Okay. Now, she heard this last year, guys, and, you know, I know for a fact because she, she re-released this, you know, just a day or so ago, but I saw this video last year when she released it on May 8th, 9, uh, 2017. She released it one year ago, okay, and I watched that video back then, and I remember this. As I drifted into a nap, I heard these words, and right away I wrote it down. Okay, here's what she heard from the Lord, guys, over by a period of May 22. You know, and we were all wondering what that meant and everything. Over by a period of May 22. Now, you can check out her video. She has another important, very important one she released with this. But the thing of it is, this is May 20, today is May 23, and it doesn't say over by May 23, it says over by a period, meaning, you know, that seems to insinuate that it's around the time of May 22. Well, last year we got all excited thinking it was, you know, May 22 of 2017, but obviously the rapture didn't happen then. 
But guys, I'm telling you, I'm really thinking this means the time period of this year, right around now, right around May 22, yesterday. I really, really believe that, and this confirms what I saw from the Lord, what I received from the Lord uh, a couple of nights ago. I've been praying about whether to release it or not, and he moved my heart to release it now that, yes, I should release it. Um, I received it from the Lord as I was waking up, which is almost always when he'll give me a word or a dream or a vision, is as I'm waking up. Okay, right, right before my eyes opened about two, well, three days ago, right before my eyes opened, I saw this message floating past. It just said, this time, it's really happening. And I instantly knew what he meant. I knew what he was talking about. He was saying, this time, it's really happening. Meaning, this time, now. The rapture, the peace treaty, it's all going down. This time, it's really happening. It's not like all he was talking about, you know, referring to all the past times. Think of all the dates that have come and gone, you know. All the things that have happened that we've gotten excited about and then nothing came of it. Okay, but that's in the past. And he's saying, this time right now, this time it's really happening. Okay, it's all about to go down. That's the interpretation and the feeling that he gave me from it. This time, guys, it's really happening. So I hope that you are rapture ready. I'm not saying the rapture is today, tomorrow, or when. All I know is you, if you're not rapture ready, you better get rapture ready. And uh, this is a powerful confirmation. It's over, over by a period of May 22. He told her it is over by this period. Okay? And there have been a couple of other people that have had probably a lot more because like I say, I don't watch a lot of dreams and visions anymore. You know, not like I used to when I first came on here because I found out there's very few people you can really trust or hear in from the Lord. So I stopped that. But I know there's a couple more that, you know, people that I really trust on here. And guys were all confirming each other. And so I hope that you are rapture ready. I hope that you are not a lukewarm Christian. You better, if you're lukewarm, if you're on the fence about coming to the Lord Jesus Christ, you better jump off that fence right now today. And you better jump into the arms of Jesus and hang on tight. You better give your heart, mind, and soul to the Lord Jesus Christ, and you better do it now. Okay, time's a wasting. You better do it now. Okay, come to him. Turn from your sin. Give your heart to Jesus Christ. Surrender yourself totally. Surrender your life and all you have to him. And do it now, guys. Repent and turn from your sin now. Okay, that's all I have to say. I just, I'm looking for the Lord Jesus Christ anytime. I don't care what anybody says. I'm looking for him at any time. You better get yourself, you better get your house squared away. You better get rapture ready because he's coming. Okay, God bless you guys. Keep looking up for him.